Logical innovation continues to advance the Nigerian business environment. The president of the Chartered Institute of Taxation of Nigeria, Mr. Adeshina Adedayo, has projected that the introduction of the e Naira into the Nigerian economy will reduce tax evasion and increase government revenue generation through taxation. Speaking at the 2021 edition of the CITN Business Luncheon in Lagos with theme digital currency technology and e Naira, nature and implication for taxation, Mr. Adedayo explains that the new digital currency will ensure the traceability of tax assets and enforce transparency in the taxation administration system of the country. According to him, the e Naira is a digital currency issued by and regulated by the Central Bank of Nigeria, which provides consumers and end users with quick, safe and simple trading and transactional opportunities that will increase financial inclusion and trade in the country. CITM president also commended the federal government and tax authorities on the giant strides made on the fiscal policy decisions and tax administration measures initiated this year in the area of Finance Act 2021 and introduction of Tax Pro Max solution by the FRS. With the digital currency as launched by the central bank, it is clear that we have a central bank regulatory framework guiding this digital currency. Why the cryptocurrency, as we have just been told by the representative of CBN, is such that the platform is so fluid that it can make people either to gain so much and also to lose so much without a regulatory backbone guiding it. If you look at the quantum of young people that are trading in digital currencies, the cryptocurrencies, they just marvel at uh, the way Nigerians are tech savvy. And I think it's a very good idea on the part of the CBN to actually move a step further and introduce the digital e Naira at this material time rather than waiting in perpetuity. For FIRS, you know, we are, we are starting to digitalize our transactions. We just have um, the tax pro max introduced into the public where you can file online, pay online, register online. And that was introduced last year. It's an in-house program that we developed in FIRS. So with that, we can quickly key into the e-Naira, 